Hey guys, welcome back to Ganshi Plans. Uh, before I start recording today's video, I just wanted to let you know the, the news that is the context. And I've been like putting off actually announcing it for real. I thought I should put it in a real video. Um, we're going to be moving in three weeks, the first week of November. So that is going to affect things. I'm um, working on like getting way ahead on videos. So I do not expect anything to drop as far as videos, at least into the end of November. Um, we're going to be in a temporary place for two months and then by around the beginning of the new year, we'll move into wherever we're headed after that. A lot of things are up in the air. So that's what's going on in my life right now. Um, today we are going to be doing a weekly plan with me. So enjoy that. Just jumping right in. Um, we are still in the pocket size Cheek Sparrow Travels Notebook. It's, um, like I'm, I'm missing something that lies flat. And I think especially oh, the, the point of the move is that I'm going to be a stay at home mom. Um, and I think I kind of would like to have something that lays flat for that. So I might move back to rings or maybe try out discs or something fun in the meantime, but, or at some point, but in the meantime, I'm going to stay here. I'm not going to change anything. It's the system was working. Um, and I don't want to spend any of the valuable time that I could be worrying about the move. Um, worrying about my planner. So I'm going to be setting up weeks in advance. That's going to be next week, uh, next week's video. But for today, we're just going to be planning this week. I'll show you quickly what last week looked like. Uh, we took a three day weekend to go and tour some new schools and stuff. So, um, that's, we did a whole eight day spread here. You may have seen that on my Instagram and today. So we're going to have a six day week, uh, for this spread. So let's jump in. I've got my straight edge and I've got a pen. Um, and I'm going to start counting. Let's see, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, two, two, three, four, five. No, I'm not, not six. This is four days. One, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, two, three, four, four, two, three, four, five, two, three, four, six, two, three, four, and then two extra spaces. So it's going to be one at the top as usual. There's usually one at the top just because that it's usually divided by five. I guess that makes sense that there would be one extra one at the top. What did I just count? Good screaming at the screen. I can't hear you. <sighs> Two, three, four, five, six. All right. That's what I thought. I didn't want to be always measure twice, count once or count two, three, four, five, six. All right. Measure twice and ink once. I say cut once. Anyway, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? One, two, three, four, five, six. So this will be Tuesday through Friday on the left side of the page. And then I'll do weekend on the other side. That's how I've been doing it. This is now is not the time to be shaking up my routine. Um, if it's working, then I will keep it. That is what I'm doing. And I'm just going to add anything else that I feel like I need in the meantime. Like for example, this page here has like some weekly to do lists for the next couple of weeks coming up. Um, because I felt like I needed that. And so that's what I've got. Um, so I've been doing like a little header row and I guess I still will. Huh. Yeah, I guess I might as well. Um, the side is where I mark the day of the week. Leaning over a little bit. All right, we're going to go all the way to the top, but not all the way to the top on this one. That was the reason why I had that black theme week. Was it last week? The week before this last week? Um, because I meant to do it like this, where I have the header row and then I have a separate, um, separate section for the days. Uh, pay attention to what I'm doing and then I'll tell you. This guy has the header row here and then this section has the side you know, marked off. But I extended this line up all the way to the top. Right. 
right here. And so I hated it. And so I, I filled it in with black and did a black and white monochrome theme that week. Didn't want to mess that up again because I already picked my colors for the week. They're right here on the desk next to me off camera. You'll see them in a second. Just basically letting a, uh, a roll of washi tape inspire me. I haven't been doing monthly color themes for a while. Um, I've just been kind of doing it week by week and not worrying about it too much, even in the days. All right, where at this point it's like it does obviously doesn't matter at all, but I've been doing my weekends to this line uh, for this entire insert, so I'm not about to change that. Like I say, if it's not broken, um, now it's a thing. I think last month's uh, monthly or weekly plan with me was the one where I just accidentally, but like kind of then by on purpose, like skipped this part where I was drawing lines. Tell me if you think this is useful or if next time I should just skip this part where I'm drawing lines and go straight to the actual planning. Because when I use printables, which I often do when I'm not in this setup, this part doesn't even exist. The lines already are there. Um, let me see. I feel like it's seven dots, but I'm going to double check. One, two, three, four, five, six, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. One more count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. Okay. Can't be too careful when you're dealing with ink. And it's an odd number. Uh, this insert has an odd number. What is that? 15 squares across, which is fine. It worked great for the three day weekend. We had the columns because I wanted to do hourly because I was worried about my our schedule. Sometimes I think of things on the weekend as needing a schedule and sometimes I think of them as needing a to-do list. And it really just depends on what the plans are for that week. So here's the theme this guy. Um, this is from Simply Gilded. It's cute little pink and brown coffee, tea, cocoa, washi tape. Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and plop it at the bottom here and do it really, really bare bones simple this time. Because if I wanted to get stickers out, they're way over there and I'd have to edit the video more to cut out the part where I go looking for them. And that is exactly how bored, or no, it's how, um, not bored. Uh, lazy. Lazy I am. But I wouldn't want to do that, but also just like, this is fine. This is fine. Okay. Oh, because I think I do actually have to go over there and get, uh, uh, what's it? Stickers for the days of the week and stuff. I'm just going to put like a header here and then a header here, um, like that, I don't care for that, it's like it's lined up to here and here, so here and here, but I don't like the way that, it's okay, it's fine, it's still centered, um, so this will be like things for this week, and this will be things for like coming up, I'll put the next week sticker anyway, all right, rummage, rummage, so that didn't take that long. Here's my sticker binder and we're going to pull out There's some sort of generic header ones here this week and next week. Then we need these days of the week ones. These stickers are from Matt, from Mad Hatter Stickers Co. And yeah, I'll just use these ones. I'm not going to use date dots right now. Put everything back and I think that's all I really need right now. I might need some um, like label boxes for uh, for events. Let me see. Come on. This week and next week fantastic except they are a slightly different sized font. 
because I don't know I guess next is a slightly longer word like in terms of actual distance let's do brown for these and pink across the top I'm not trying to be too precise about it you can't really be with the brush pens yeah, it's a little wibbly. A little bit wibbly. Alright. We've got Tuesday. And I'm filming this on Tuesday. I should usually tell you that so you know in case I slip and use like words like today and yesterday, which I may have already done. Uh, you'll know what I'm talking about. I'm filming this on Tuesday at lunch. Um, so don't even sometimes start my planning for the week until I'm partway into the day because, you know, I'm working. I still have two more weeks of work. Um, I'll go ahead and use this one. Yes, no. Yeah. I'm going to put it in this corner. Will that work? So we've got Tuesdays the 18th. Yes. Again, triple check that in your brain. 18, 19, 20. This is nice and very light colored, so it should be very subtle. 23. All right. So basically what I'm think worrying about and thinking about is like the things that are happening on the weekends, because we still have quite a full booked social calendar through until our move, which the things about like I don't know, the way God speaks to us in discernment lately has been through timing. And it seems like, again, that's just another thing with timing. It, it works out. Um, so we have a baptism coming up. and Anyway, so these are some things that are on my weekly to-do list. Um, and so I think I'm really just going to... I don't want to move stuff around and try to rely on this list when I already have this list. It's right there. Um but I'm going to put, let's see, is there anything on my monthly that needs to be put here? Like little tasks. Yeah, I was going to make a wand for my two-year-old's Abby Kadabi costume, but I think she's happy with the little plastic wand she already has. Um, she's not going to be a stickler for um, screen accuracy. And the little prop wand that matches perfectly. And there's no small tasks until next week so really it's just events and the events for this week include tomorrow wednesday is my get it done day so today's it's just like yeah i say well, there's tasks right so this is the week plan with me i'll just put yeah week plan with me which is what i'm doing right now this is thursday's video and then on wednesday i'm going to be filming stuff ahead for the coming up. Um, so if you, you know, request any videos, they are not going to be happening until probably December. I have things booked up until then. Um, but this day here is my day off. So I'm going to put just a little, a little pink hoop like that. And just put a little get it done which is sort of the point that's what i've been calling it my get it done day um i've been using up some of my pto work which now kind of doesn't matter because i'm not going to be accruing it i'm going to be cashing it out but i still uh, need this time to get ahead on my videos so that, that won't be something distracting me from all of the business of moving and turning into a stay-at-home mom. I feel like that's a transformation in myself that I'm trying to figure out and navigate and, you know, 
determine how that's going to work. Uh, and then, yeah, I don't think there's very much going on Thursday, Friday, but I do usually put a little strip, or have been putting a little strip of washi tape. This is the super cheapy stuff that I got off, like, I want to, I was going to say Amazon, but I think I got it off AliExpress, and it is really bad. Um, the adhesive on the back is, like, really patchy, and so it'll often, like, peel. So, the good news about that is that I'm going to be putting a sticker over the top too. If you've been wondering, because sometimes I've been just doing this in um, my like weekly plan with me's, just adding these stickers and I don't explain what they're for, but um, I'm allowed to work from home three days a week and then go into the office Thursday, Friday. So that's why I put this little strip here. It just affects what I can do on like my breaks and stuff. Um, so there we go. That'll sort of tape it down as well. Um, we have the baptism, I mean, yeah, I guess I'm just going for, and then we've got a, oh, this is actually happening later in the day than this, but it doesn't matter, I think that's all right, yeah, so we have baptism. My niece is being baptized on Saturday, and then we have a retirement party, a military retirement party we're going to. And then this will be mass, but I don't know where yet. And then I'm going to sort of use this throughout the week. Um, I may or may not even use it, but whatever. It doesn't matter, right? All that, if I don't use this, all that's wasted is two stickers that I had a bunch of anyway. Um, I will also be working off this and probably off dailies if I feel like I need to like focus and actually like get stuff done. Like tomorrow, I want to make a, a daily for this, I think. Though I have been using digital planning for a lot of my content stuff, which I will probably do a video about at some point. Um, but for now, this is pretty basic. Um, it has... Yeah, it has a couple of events on it. Um, I was gonna go, I'm definitely going to go to, I'll put it here. I'm going to the school mass. Why did I just put 3.30? It's 8.30. I'm going to the school mass. And then I'm going to get it all done. Uh, because I'm not gonna have a chance, probably, to have an entire day uh, to focus on content creation without the kids. Uh, for a while. It's it's going to be a, a shift. I'm going to have to figure out how I'm doing things for the channel. I'm not going to be changing too much in what's actually coming out, um, except for maybe some of the content might be a little bit different. Excuse me, my computer was supposed to be muted. Um, but yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. I uh, hope you enjoyed that. And if you have any suggestions for how to transform myself and my personality into that of a stay-at-home mom, uh, I would appreciate that because it's going to be new and different and exciting. Um, so yeah, stay tuned, ring the bell, um, and I will be posting videos every Thursday all the way through. So see you in the next one. Bye!